Hi everyone! Today we're going to make a very classic and popular Gong Pao chicken. If you wonder why it's called uh, Gong Pao chicken, long story short, it is named after an official in Qin Dynasty. His last name is Ding and his title is Gong Pao. And uh, he often made uh, stir fry chicken with uh, chili peppers and also peanuts. Everybody loved it and they named the dish after his title, Gong Pao literally means the pilot's garden and uh, I'm going to show you how to make the Kung Pao sauce. The dish is normally made of chicken thigh or chicken leg meat and by now you know I prefer chicken breast and also we have a few chili peppers so it depends on how spicy you like. I have a few of them. And I have some Sichuan peppercorns. And we have two green onions. Just cut them into pieces like this. And two cloves of garlic. So cut into dices like that and we need some ginger cut to the same size. Next we're going to Cut the chicken. You have one chicken breast. First, you just trim the fat. Like I said, you, know, you can just use dark meat, chicken thigh, chicken leg, meat. Just my personal preference. I like chicken breast. Just cut into pieces like this. Now we we'll just cut into dices. Next, we're going to season the chicken. Add a little bit of salt, white pepper powder. Dark soy sauce, if you have it, for color. Mix well. Add about one tablespoon cornstarch. Add some oil. Add one tablespoon light soy sauce. And one tablespoon dark vinegar. And about a tablespoon cooking wine. Shaoxing cooking wine. If you don't have cooking wine, you can use chicken stock and about a teaspoon sugar so this will be sweet and sour flavor and about one tablespoon cornstarch and about quarter cup water now we mix this well This is a pan fried peanuts. You can check out my hot and sour noodles. I showed how to do the pan fried peanuts. If you don't have it, you can use the dry roasted peanuts. 
Now we are ready to cook. We heat up the pan to high, add some oil. First, we're going to stir fry the chicken. We'll take a, a few minutes. After a few minutes, our chicken almost done. Let's set aside. Mm, smells good. Now we're going to saute the pepper, chili peppers, citron pepper corn. Here's a uh, garlic and ginger. Okay, I've got uh, 10, 15 seconds. It smells good. Now we add the chicken back. Now we add our kung pao sauce, mix well before you add it. Now we add our pan fried peanuts and green onions. Mix well. Our kung pao chicken is ready. Mmm, smells so good. I can't wait to eat for you guys. Let's have some. Just made the fresh rice. Chicken, so tender, and a sweet and sour taste. Peanuts, delicious. Mmm. Sauce just perfect. You can also taste the spiciness from chili peppers. And they can taste the citron peppercorns, a little bit of nami. Mmm. So delicious. You know, with that sauce, if you check out my channel, I also made the kung pao lotus root for vegetarians. I also made the kung pao shrimp. And uh, please, please try it. Let me know how you like it. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.